Residents of Hainamula and Kurunagala say they are facing severe hardships due to the construction of the Central Expressway, ignoring environmental reports. The second phase of the Central Expressway from Mirigama to Kurunagala is currently under construction. Area residents claim that environmental edicts have been flouted as construction crews cause noise pollution exceeding the maximum decibel levels. They say the use of explosives to demolish large rocks has caused the walls of their homes to fracture. There is no compensation. We will be forced to beg. Why are they doing this to us? We are only asking for what we are due. Our needs are not unreasonable. When they drill, the noise is unbearable. Our homes vibrate. The environmental reports say clearly that the people residing here must be relocated or they will be unable to cope with the noise. It could cause abnormalities for pregnant women. Children could go deaf, but there is no consideration whatsoever. When we go to the police, the SSP says it is karma and that we must bear it. Does the law only exist for the good of the big wigs? Is there no law to assist us? Farmers in Hainamulla claim that the ongoing construction activity has had a severely detrimental effect on their cultivations. Central Expressway Phase 3 Contract granted to two Japanese companies violating tender procedure. Loan obtained at high interest rates instead of state concessionary credit from the Japanese government. Decision to award the contract for 134 billion rupees when the engineering estimate costed the project at 123 billion rupees. One of the companies which has been awarded the contract is facing allegations by the Japan Fair Trade Commission for tender fraud. Won't projects of this nature that are embroiled in corruption further burden the people and the country? For your attention.